of Women under the aegis of the Amalgamation of Northern Women Association on Saturday demanded a, a referendum to allow Biafra dictators to choose whether or not to remain in Nigeria. The coordinator of the group, Hadiza Adamu, spoke on the behalf of other members during a protest in Abuja on Saturday. She said Nigerian history has shown that women carry the heavy burden of war and acts of insurrection and terrorism. We have gone through it from 1967 to 1971. Our men died and left us with the children to cater for out of nothing. Other men that survived simply moved on, but we never moved on. The aftermath of the war and the suffering left lifetime scars in our hearts and our bodies. It is for this reason that we have come together today and say we don't want another war, another insurrection. We therefore anonymously call on President Muhammad Buhari as the leader and the father of the country and the leadership of the National Assembly, the President uh, of the Senate, Dr. Ahmed Lawa, and the Speaker of the House of the Representatives, Honorable Femi Banjabiamila, to immediately call for a referendum in the country. Let people choose to live in peace in Nigeria or leave. Any other group or nationality that wants to succeed to exercise their right of self-determination like the Southeast has been agitated for decades to be allowed to leave Nigeria peacefully without resorting to a second civil war. Today, the Igbo nation has turned the entire Southeast to almost a war zone. Northerners, irrespective of their tribes, are no longer safe. Stakes, infrastructures, uh, are no longer safe. Service personnel from police to army are not safe. INEC offices and other symbols of democracy in the country are being destroyed on a daily basis. Our husbands that go to do businesses in the Southeast no longer return home safe. Our political leaders who travel to the Southeast on national assignments are assassinated in broad daylight. And these have generated so many reactions from Nigerians. Some are saying that uh, it was a sponsor, the, um, what is it called? Protest. Why some are saying that they have just speaking, they have just spoken the mind of the Southeasterners because they, they've seen what that is uh, really coming, you know, that is going to be too disastrous. All right. Someone said, uh, allow the Biafra to go and any other one. We are sick and tired of criminality, uh, dominance, okay, propaganda or whatever. All right, someone says, see this devil talking. And someone just replied this, friend, must you talk in that manner? If you are tired of the egos, why not support the referendum? Yeah, uh, Nigerians are calling for a referendum. That, uh, the federal gov government should just con con uh, conduct that maybe if if they find out that people did not support self-determination then that means nigeria stays but if people say no i vote for self-determination and want to go to our nation that means the nigerian government have no uh, any reason to still keep them so this is what nigerians most nigerians have been asking the federal government to do mostly those in the southeast and the southwest. All right. Even the the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazenam the Kano, has called on the federal government, you know, to conduct a referendum to find out if people are seeing interested, you know, in the in Nigeria uh, country. The uh, Oduduwa Nation to the Professor Akintoye, uh, Igbo, Sunday Igbo, those ones are saying that Nigerian government, you know, should conduct a referendum. Let them see if people are still interested in this country, Nigeria. Then, if people are still interested in Nigeria, so be it. But if people now say no, huh, 
I'm no longer interested or we are no longer interested in this country. We are going, you know, to our nation. That means federal government does not have any reason to keep anybody. So it's not led for the federal, federal government, you know, to choose what to do. All right, someone said, oh, yes, it's time to let the sons and daughters of all these uh, showers to go to their way. So then they can continue to deliver more baby factory pro <laughs> products like Nandekano. Okay, someone said, Chai, a book in a book you. Hmm. It's a lie. Some people sponsor them just to act as if they are not in as uh, less concerned about certain agitators. So let them try the referendum and see where it ends. They will not dare it. All right. I okay. Someone said that is the only solution. A referendum is the uh, last hope of the common man because it seems to be not nothing is working in Nigeria. So if you have a problem with your family or any feeling of injustice, separating from that your family is a solution and not finding a better options for the problem. Someone just asked that question, replied, you know, the first comment. All right, Nigerians are still uh, talking. Okay, someone said, hmm. The women have shown that they are better than the men when it comes to thinking, faculty, more, more grace to them. Okay, God bless those northern women. It has proved that women are always better uh, leaders than the men, he said. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Let's hear from you. Hit the comment section and don't forget to give us thumbs up. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye for now. Thank you.